Good morning guys, I am extremely tired because it is, it's 4.17 in the morning and I've got to be gone in about 10 minutes, 10 or 15 minutes because I have work this morning. Today, me and Amy are doing a detox day, we agreed on it because we had a pretty filthy weekend for that wedding, um, not filthy, but we drank a lot and ate a lot and we both said we need a detox. Amy's got it sorted actually. Amy's Amy's gonna have like a proper detox day. She's gonna be having like a, I don't know, she reckons she's gonna be having like a, a mask day, exfoliation. The only thing I can really do is have this smoothie she's prescribed me. Um, if you have a look at this, this is the detox smoothie that we're both going to be having detox day. I didn't really think about it too much when I said it. I was a little bit flippant and Amy was like, I was thinking the exact same thing, let's have a detox day. There goes nothing. Oh, that's it. Let's, uh, let's begin this day. Jason has said hello to you all but good morning it is now 6:30. it's obviously a couple hours since Jason vlogged he's now gone to work Jason did have a couple of days off because we went to a wedding and he has to go back into work into the office in Perth for two days so he gets to come home but he has to go to work for two days and then he is off for his week. But like Jason said, we are doing a detox day. So this morning I'm starting my day with a fresh lemon water. So I'm gonna do that quickly while making Frederick's breakfast. Breakfast and lemon water are done and you probably are wondering why I'm taking lemon water this morning. Obviously I am detoxing today, I'm doing a whole cleanse today because my body needs it, especially after the weekend we've had. We went to a wedding on Saturday and we obviously had some alcohol and I just need to cleanse my body, cleanse my skin, everything to get rid of all the stuff that I put on it or in it in the weekend. The reason why I was having lemon water is because it's really good to cleanse your body and lemons cleanse your body from the inside. Lemons also provide hydration, antioxidants, and electrolytes, which is also good for like hangovers. Even though I don't have one, it's really good for hangovers. So tip there, if you have a hangover, drink lemon water. And also lemons are a good source of vitamin C, potassium, and folate. So it's just an all round good thing to do. Even if you don't want to detox or anything, lemon water is really good to start off your day because it gives your body the boost it needs every single day. We're going to actually head out to the beach because the salt from the beach will actually do really good wonders to our skin. So we're going to go down for a little walk and a swim at the beach. So I've grabbed Frederick's clothes and his nappy ready for us to go down. Also going to go down to IGA this morning to go get some vegan goodies. Um, so yeah. Let's get this, this munchkin here, we're ready for the beat. We're all ready to go and let's go to the beach. Frederick had a two hour nap and it is time for Frederick and I to have some lunch. So today for lunch we're doing a big bowl of veggies. We totally need more veggies especially after our weekend. Even though we weren't eating bad we obviously consumed alcohol. The things that I've got that I'm including into our lunch today is some 
Beetroot, I just got the canned beetroot because I couldn't find any like actual beets at the shops yesterday. Beets are really good because they help with boosting your immune system and they have a good vitamin C in them. So beets help with purifying your blood and your liver. And because we were drinking alcohol, we need to clean out our liver. So that's why we got beets today. We also got some chickpeas because chickpeas are amazing. They're a high fiber source. They help with improving your digestion. And also they are good for healing your skin. And because we drank alcohol, my skin's probably not really liking me right now. I do have a little bit of a breakout happening on my chin and I wanna make sure that I can clear that up as fast as as possible so obviously one thing I'm doing is having chickpeas one of the other things I'm adding into our lunch today is spinach spinach is absolutely amazing and you definitely should add it into your meals more spinach is absolutely amazing it helps with maintaining healthy skin and it also is good for constipation even though I don't have that we want to you know not have it we want to prevent it so that's why I'm having some spinach does lunch look today so good so I've got my beetroot spinach chickpeas pumpkin tomato a uh, tomato I meant potato and I've got broccoli and cauliflower is down the bottom this isn't the best place for me to eat lunch but at the moment Frederick's having some quiet time unless you can hear him in the background because he wants a new TV show on but Frederick's having some quiet time. It's a perfect time for me to sit down at the computer, do some writing while I'm having my lunch, while I'm drinking my water, getting some work done so I don't have to do it tonight and sacrifice family time when Jason comes home from work. Now that lunch is done, I'm going to slap on a face mask on my face. I need to get a hair tie first because I need to put my hair up for when I put a face mask on it because I don't like getting stuff in my hair, especially when I just cleaned it. So I'm gonna put a face mask on to help with these few, and you probably can't really tell, but I've got a few breakouts at the moment just because of the makeup that they used on me um, for the wedding. As soon as like the wedding was over, I could see my pores were like enlarged dramatically and they were all filled and everything. I popped so many white heads on my nose the the morning after the wedding and I was just like my face has never reacted like this to makeup but it's okay. I'm dealing with it and that's the main thing. I still look good on the day. But that is the main thing. I still looked really good at the wedding. But I'm gonna put a face mask on so I'm gonna put my lush one on, the cupcake one. I'm gonna put my hair out. And then I'm going to put some workout shorts on and we're going to go outside and do some yoga. Yoga is done. That was a good little fast yoga session. It was only like 10 minutes. It was really good. My face is dry now, so I'm going to wash it off. But I just want to say how happy I am to get that last move. It's one I've been trying to get for the last like week or so. And I finally actually got it. I got the courage to go all the way back, bend as much as possible and lift my leg to a point. I'm so happy I got it. So, so, so happy. Ah, I can't believe I got it. Next one, headstand. So it's been a couple of hours and it is now five to six. Jason has got home from work, but I can't really show you him. Well, I can, but I can't show Frederick because Frederick's having naked time at the moment. But say hello to Jason. Hello. <laughs> so at the moment I am cooking tea tonight. We are having um, nachos. I am currently making a vegan nacho cheese, which will be amazing. But I got all the stuff out here. So I've got some uh, Mission Tortilla 
corn chips, we've got some kale, avocado, some tomato relish, we've also got some corn, and we've got some black beans. I'm not too sure if we're putting anything else on this. I have no idea, but so far that is everything that I've got. I just need to wait for this water to cool down in my nacho cheese, and then I can actually blend it and make it and make the nacho. So this is what dinner is looking like. I am going to put it in the oven so this is not the finished product. It still has to like melt and get all gooey and all that kind of stuff. wanted to talk to you guys about what we've got on here and why it's so good and all this kind of stuff before I put it in the oven. So obviously we've got avocado on here and avocado is a great superfood. It's got vitamin A, B, C, E and K in it. It also is a good food fat so it's like amazing for you. We've obviously got our black beans in here which is our protein. It's like one of the best beans you can eat for protein. I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on that guys. So my nacho cheese is made with a bunch of stuff but nutritional yeast is in it and it's a superfood and every vegan or everybody should be having nutritional yeast. It's absolutely amazing and it tastes so cheesy and it makes everything delicious. So yeah. Just some of our benefits for tea tonight. I totally forgot to show you guys when we were sitting down, like us eating kind of, but having family time and all that kind of stuff, but we got carried away and I totally forgot to pick up the camera, but it's okay. Dinner is done, Jason scoffed it, so did Frederick, so did me. We've got a tiny bit of leftovers, um, which Jason's going to take with him to work tomorrow, because he's got one more day of work until his week off, which is really good. Um, so he's gonna get a good meal for his last lunch, which is really good. I'm going to say goodbye to you guys because we're not doing anything else. We're just going to be chilling at home, just us three. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed, Freddie goes to sleep early because he had an early nap today. Fingers crossed, guys. Keep them crossed for me. I guess we'll see you guys all in a couple of days. So I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and maybe hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video. You'll probably enjoy more. So definitely hit that subscribe button and we'll see you all in a couple of days. Bye.